Miss Diamond Wedding Ring. Aww. I wanted that. <laughs> Cousin Judy got the blender. Aww. I could have used that. <laughs> Uncle Maury got the pasta machine. Aww. That they could have. <laughs> their side. Let's get to our side. Their side? Our side? Who's keeping score? Meanwhile, it's three zip. <laughs> oh, please. Ma, calm down. You're schwitzing already. Soon you're gonna slide off the couch. <laughs> this is such a trying time for me. Life won't be the same without my beloved Mima. Shut up, Marsha. And the coat goes to Francine! Come on down! <laughs> she gave Fran the coat. Who schlepped it to the beauty parlor every week to get her three hairs set? <laughs> Who smeared it with Ben Gay after shuffleboard and, and after she got the hammer toe fixed? Who lugged her around? <laughs> My husband, that's who. Well, you can keep the coat, because I don't want it. What are you, nuts? <laughs> why? Ma, I only wear fake fur. And do you know why? Yes, because no one ever died and left you a real one before. <laughs> no, I have a very impressionable teenager at home that needs to know that I stick by my beliefs and I believe in animal rights. Fran, a mink is not an animal. It's a rodent. <laughs> if it was up in the attic, you would be the first one to call Terminex. <laughs> Ma, knock it off. I'm not putting a dead animal anywhere near me. Pass the tongue. Oh. <laughs> Fran, you're keeping the coat. No, I'm not. And do we have to discuss this in front of everyone? No, we'll discuss it in there. Fine. Excuse us. <laughs> they don't want to talk in front of us. How could you turn your back on everything that I raised you to believe in? This is mink! Ma, if you love the mink so much, why don't you keep it? I'm too busty. <laughs> Didn't stop you from wearing a tube top to temple. <laughs> it's reform. Ma, forget it. I'm not taking the coat. You know, you're killing me with this. If I die tonight, you'll never forgive yourself. Ma, I'm a grown woman. You can't use guilt on me anymore to get what you want. Oh. What's the matter, Ma? Nothing. I just hope I'm not getting that weird flesh-eating disease. <laughs> we couldn't hear. I'm not sure. There was one call. A sob, a sigh, and a long, plaintive, oi. Well, either that's how our AT&T is really depressed that we switched to Sprint. <laughs> I can't believe she would stoop to crank guilt calls. How low can she go? Hey, you're talking about a woman that could grow a tumor on command. <laughs> Well, it's not going to work. I'm a grown woman. I'm entitled to my own opinions, and no silent treatment is going to make me compromise my ideals. That coat is staying in Queens. Thank you. <laughs> oh, can you believe her? Huh? Didn't she hear a word I said? I don't want this disgustingly soft, lush, lush. Oh, Niles, did you see the satin lining? Boy, they don't make it like that anymore. Oh, it does become you, Miss Fine. Oh, no. Niles is absolutely repulsive. I can't stand it. <laughs> Up or down? <laughs> oh, take it off me. Take it off. Oh, look at the initials. M.F. Mima Fager. Miss Fine. It's like it was meant to be. <laughs> well, you could always send it to Morgan Freeman. 